with cute appearance and plenty of patience, Bingo has become a popular teacher among Chinese children. And it's a robot. The humanoid, powered by artificial intelligence, has appeared in kindergartens across China to teach pupils as the country faces serious shortage of teachers. Bingo, one of the first robotic kindergarten teachers in the country, has been designed to specialize in various subjects, from science to English to golf, according to its developer. Ming Haibo, who has a PhD degree in computer science from distinguished Tsinghua University in Beijing, started developing Bingo three years ago with his team after founding his company iBingo, Love Bingo. A father of two young children, the 36 year old man started out his business by creating a robot to teach children at home. Speaking to Mail Line, Dr. Ming said he seldom had time to accompany his children due to busy work, therefore, he thought of the idea of making a cute and educational robot for them. He said he also believed that robots would have great advantages in helping children review the knowledge they learn from school and correct children's homework. Dr. Ming's company now has two types of bingo robot, one to teach children at kindergartens, that sells for 29,800 yuan, 3,400 pounds, and one to accompany children at home with a retail price of 1,199 yuan, 136 pounds. China is facing a serious shortage of kindergarten teachers, especially after the central government encouraged couples to have more babies. In 2016, Beijing launched a new family planning policy to replace the long-standing one-child policy, which allows families to have up to two children. According to a previous report from China News, the country will have 15 million boys and girls needing preschool education by 2021 a number its educational system would not be able to handle. With the growing number of young children, the country will be facing a shortage of 110,000 kindergartens and more than 3 million teachers in two years, it has been reported. At the same time, around 30% of the current kindergarten teachers in China reportedly leave their teaching job to work in other industries each year in order to earn higher wages. It comes as little surprise that kindergartens and nurseries around China have enlisted robots to help with their faculty members. Bingo, for example, has been purchased by around 1,500 kindergartens in major cities including Beijing, Tianjin, Jiangsu, and Wuhan. The robot has been programmed to teach a series of subjects including science, English, golf and the art of speaking with more curricula installed in a database in the cloud, according to Drive.
Ming.at A typical lesson, Bingo can recognize pupils and check their attendance by scanning their faces with its camera, powered by facial recognition technology. The robot can ask questions to the class as well as answer questions from the children. It is capable of rating the pupils' answers by listening to their speech and detecting their facial expressions, and afterwards Bingo will grade each child's performance using a special rating system developed by the company and send the results directly to parents. Bingo's camera is installed about 78 centimeters 30 inches above the ground, which is the average sitting height of a Chinese child in a kindergarten, and its arms and head are built with enhanced material in order to sustain repeated touches from curious children. Dr.Ming said the next step for his company is to develop an upgraded version of Bingo which can display a wide range of emotions in order for it to be a more capable and gentle teacher for small children. Chinese firms have invested a large amount of money and manpower on developing AI technology in recent years as part of the central government's effort to reposition the country to be a high-tech manufacturing powerhouse by 2025. Last week, Xinhua News Agency welcomed its first female AI anchor Ku Xiaoming after unveiling two virtual male presenters last year. As the country's state-run press agency, Xinhua is expanding its team of AI newsreaders which are based on their popular human journalists. Meanwhile, a female robot host, Jian Lai Lai, has wowed the Chinese television viewers after appearing in a new entertainment program last month. 